which trips off the um, the old lights. But yeah, I whacked it, oh, the camera with this uh, with this really low door here. And there's like a water drip here somewhere. Uh, wow. Hmm. Should I just like walk around or can I take my bike with as I walk or? Uh, I wouldn't, right, well you can't take it upstairs because it, it's going to be difficult with the If you yes. want to lean it against the tree or here, it's fine. But if you want to take it with you on ground level, that's fine too. Okay, yeah. yeah but we're always, we're going to be here keeping an eye on things, so. Uh, sure. Well, I'll just probably push it along then. It's, yeah, yeah I'm just going to stay on the ground floor. Whatever you'd like. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, so uh, guys, there's all sorts of uh, confectionery things here. Um, and yeah, there's like stables and stuff. So it's a nice little, oh, and you see, there's one, two, three, four, five uh, old cannons and stuff there. Um, Let's get figgy with it. Um, so yeah, old, old uh, lookout windows, and here's like some storage. Um, for that play, 48th New York Volunteers garrisoned Fort Pulaski after the Confederates surrendered the fort. <clears throat> um, so yeah, guys, from the the commissary here, um. See, they have like a big gun there and a little gun here. Wow. Um, imagine what would that do to to a person, um, guys. And yeah, what I'm noticing is that there's a lot of history here, um, guys. Uh, from there's a lot of. Uh, Civil War history around this fort. Um, so, but this was actually a Union um, outpost in the Deep South. So yeah, it took like 30 hours for them to breach. Um, 
Um, So it was built between 1829 and 1847 here, guys. Um, huh. Membership role of this officers and privates of the German volunteers. Hmm. Yeah, so there were um, there were German volunteers fighting uh, I guess fighting for the Union I would say but anyways guys hasta la chao chao bye for now over and out from the concrete fortress jungle of Fort Pulaski Georgia